What we want to work on here is I'm going to be about 30 feet away, and I'm actually going to be on one knee for this drill. We can be on one knee, could be standing about 40 feet away. We're going to work on different pitches. Now, you don't have to be, you don't have to have a, a nasty breaking ball for this. You just have to simulate somewhat of a breaking ball here and just get the catcher to feel the footwork, all right? So we're going to work on throwing footwork, all right? And we're going to work on basically having the catcher find his feet on different pitches. Now, fastball. Dave works on getting the fastball here. Fastball again. Curve. Now, I don't have a great curveball, but you don't need one here. We're, we're simulating it. Just let it drop in there. Main thing is he's seeing the break. He's getting the idea of how the ball breaks in. And move it around the strike zone. The other one I like to practice, too, is this one here, down by his, his right foot. So he's got to wait for it and stay back. Really wait on this one, Dave. Last one. Good. And that's, um, that's throwing footwork. Dave here is going to work on the two-knee drill with me. Now, what we want to work on here is, is keeping the glove in the target. We're going to go down on two knees. We're going to start with our glove here in front of our chin or our chest. We're going to actually turn and rotate. Get into the T position here. Head on the target, glove, eyes, ball. Now all we're doing here is we're just getting ourselves lined up, shoulder to shoulder, glove to glove. Dave's going to give me a target. I'm going to point my glove at his. I'm going to throw through. If I fall forward, it's not a big deal. Just catch yourself on the way down. Go ahead, Dave. Hands together when you start. Break, turn, turn at the waist, throw. Always try to deliver right to his target. Now, as your catchers get better at this, we're going to do it a little quicker. You can do it a little bit quick. Work on the transfer here. So you're here to transfer the ball back and forth. And this will be good for when you're going to work on throwing out runners. You're just working back and forth. Players can make a game. Anytime you mess it, hit it inside the shirt and the target, all right, you can, you can score a point. Throwing back to the pitcher is a real important skill, and a lot of times we take it for granted. I mean, there's some major league players, catchers, that their careers ended because they couldn't re reach the pitcher effectively. Now, proper footwork here is very simple, all right? All we're working on is after we've caught the ball, we're going to drop our left knee to the ground. And we're going to almost put a stick, put a post in the ground here, get our arms in the T position. We're going to push here and just rotate forward. All right, and what happens a lot of times is this, we get, in, we get lazy as catchers, we get tired, and we, we flop the ball back. If you notice here, my right, arm, my right arm is releasing the ball high, my left arm is off the target, and it's creating a lot of imbalance here when I go to throw. It may not show up initially, but over time, this bad habit, is from, instead of this here to this, will show up somewhere on the line and on the field when we really need it. So in review, we want to catch the ball here, wherever it is, in our receiver stance, catch it, left knee down, post up here, turn and throw. Keep the glove inside here. Now, reel back for one second. We want to keep the glove inside our shirt all the time, Whenever, if we're doing the two knee drill here or throwing back to the pitcher here. So we're going to work on giving a target, catching the ball, left knee down, right knee up, turn and rotate. And he's ready, waiting, I'm back, good, back and forth. You can do this from 30 to 40 feet, 30 to 60 feet really, as long as your catchers can handle it. And as they get better, you'll see a lot more, or I should say a lot less, of the balls flying around in the infield. And those are the two daily dozen throwing drills that I think every catcher should do every day.